October 5th, St. Placid and Companions, Martyrs. St. Placid was born in Rome in the year 1515 of a patrician family, and at seven years of age was taken by his father to the Benedictine monastery of Subiaco, recently founded, in order to be educated. At thirteen years of age, he followed St. Benedict to a new foundation at Monte Cassino, where he grew up in the practices of a wonderful austerity and innocence of life. He had scarcely completed his twenty-first year when he was chosen to found a monastery at Messina in Sicily upon some estates which his father had given to St. Benedict. He spent four years in building that monastery. There, miracles made him known, and it was said that his humility was so perfect, and he had such charm that it earned for him the affection of all. He could not see a poor man without hastening to aid him. One day he cured all the sick of the island at the same time, when they were brought and assembled before him for his benediction. The fifth year spent by the monks in Messina had not yet ended, when a band of Sarsian pirates, who had already he killed a great many persons burnt everything to the ground in the year 541 they then put to a lingering death not only placid and thirty monks who had joined him but also his two brothers and his holy sister who had come to visit him the entire flotilla of invaders perished however when these barbarians left the island amid a sudden storm although they had a hundred ships and numbered over sixteen thousand not one ship or passenger survived a religious who had escaped notice wrote to st benedict an account of the massacre after burying the martyrs st placid was the first benedictine martyr and the monastery of messina which was rebuilt not long afterwards was henceforth known by his name reflection adversity is the touchstone of the soul because it makes manifest the degree of its virtue one act of thanksgiving when matters go wrong is worth a thousand thanks when all things please us